Facebook removes the trending news section from its homepage, plus a preview of Apple's upcoming Worldwide Developers Conference and BlackBerry's soon-to-be-released Key2 smartphone. It's all the tech news that's popular this week. Welcome to Hashtag Trending. It's Monday, June 4th, and I'm Mandy Kovacs. First up from Facebook is a story about, well, Facebook. The social media platform announced plans on Friday to discontinue its trending news module this week. The feature is located on the right side of a user's newsfeed and provides links to news stories that people are sharing and discussing across the site. Facebook's head of news products, Alex Hardiman, said that the product has become less and less useful over time and it will be removed entirely. The trending news section was launched in 2014 to immediate controversy, as many of the stories on it were found to be intentionally false or misleading. Facebook will try experimenting with other new products apparently, including a section called Today In that includes breaking and local news, but but there is no timeline for that just yet. Next from Twitter, Apple's big Worldwide Developers Conference starts today and goes until June 8th in San Jose, California. While the rumor mill has been unusually quiet leading up to this year's four-day event, the conference is known for unveiling big iOS updates and hardware announcements, just like last year's HomePod smart speaker unveiling. On the agenda this year are several iOS workshops that prioritize performance and reliability improvements for the iPhone, as well as a few augmented reality workshops, which hints at Apple's desire to further delve into this space. Bloomberg is also suggesting that Apple wants to give developers a break by allowing them to develop a single app for both iOS and macOS. Given that the iOS App Store was revamped in 2017, look out for some type of macOS refresh. It's highly unlikely any hardware updates will be released as those are usually unveiled in the fall, but look out for some software improvements and maybe new added features. And last but not least from Twitter again, BlackBerry's much-anticipated Key2 premium Android smartphone is officially launching on June 7th. The TCL-made phone is the second generation of the successful Key1, which was released last year to fantastic reviews and much excitement. The Key 2 will come with BlackBerry's signature QWERTY keyboard, as well as dual-band Wi-Fi and Android Oreo out of the box. Insiders say to expect a big, long-lasting battery that can easily power you through a whole day without recharging, a dual camera, a bigger screen, as well as a faster processor and more RAM than its predecessor. The Key 1 sold for around 200 Canadian dollars on a two-year contract, so expect similar pricing for the Key 2. Well, that's what's trending today and what's coming up this week. If you enjoy Hashtag Trending, you might like the Business Leadership Podcast. Hosted by Edwin Frondozo, the weekly podcast features leadership strategy conversations with top tech executives and always includes actionable items. It's a partner of the ITWC Podcast Network, so be sure to go check it out. You can find past episodes or more ITWC content on itbusiness.ca slash podcasts. Once again, I'm Andy Kovacs.